Hi Great Rift student, so in this video we are going to do introduction of fixed assets. So I took one of the previous question paper. So this question paper is, is from part of item 2 and is paper 2. So it was Eastern Cape Province a question paper during examination for 2022. Make sure that you check other provinces that I did as well so that you will learn how they try to set different kind of question paper so that you will master yourself when it comes to this topic of fixed assets. Okay, so as you can see on the question paper uh, 4.1, they said fixed assets, you are provided with the information from the record of Fekeza Traders LTD, the financial year ended 30 June 2022. Okay, required, complete the following account, its equipment, account, accumulated depreciation for equipment and assets disposal. Okay. Uh, total is 35 marks, including internal uh, audit procedure. Okay. Uh, information number one. As you can see, some of the balances they were already provided. Okay. Here it was 90,000. It was provided as a balance. Okay. Here we didn't have any balance. Okay. Information they said on 31 March 2022, old office furniture was sold for cash at a profit of 2000 okay and this furniture was bought at a cost of 35000 on 1 july there was a disposal here which means that assets disposal is going to have impact okay equipment of cost to price of 35000 was sold and you know that if we had a profit we are called profit this side profit on sales of assets Okay, and they said it's 2000. Okay, this side we have to record bank as well as accumulated depreciation. Okay, so bank we're going to get it as a balancing figure. As you know, that this side in total is going to get 37,000, and this side uh, is going to be the same amount of 37 thousand okay we must find a, a depreciation first okay how are we going to calculate depreciation they said that it was bought 1 july 2020 we have to calculate depreciation from 1 july 2020 until it is uh, sold on 2022 which means that there is a somehow it's almost like a two years let's start by calculating the first one let's check the police Depreciation is calculated at 20% per annum on carrying veil, diminishing balance method. But on year one, diminishing balance method is like a cost price because we don't have what accumulated because it's still zero. Okay, it's 35,000 by 20%, which is going to give us 7,000. 7,000. But from the following year, on 1 July uh, 2021 until it's sold on 31 March 2022, which is two years. This is how we're going to calculate it. We're going to say 35,000 minus 7,000 now. Okay. Then after that, we get carrying amount. And we multiply by, uh, if you count, it's going to give you 9 over 12 months. multiply by 20%. Then you will get a depreciation of 4,200. So you have to add these two depreciation. From the day of purchase until it has been sold. Okay. If you add them, these two, they are going to give you 11,200. Okay, and when you say this one minus this one uh, is going to give you amount of 28, uh, 25,800 as a balancing figure, this one. Okay, now because we already calculated this depreciation and you know that under accumulated depreciation, we record this side only the current year depreciation, like the one of 4,200. This one, guys, of 7,000 is old. Don't include it. Okay, we have depreciation on equipment 
that has been sold uh, the amount is 4200 okay and now the total including the one of current year and the old one we have to record it under accumulated depreciation as asset disposal of 11200 why are we taking it out because guys we no longer have that uh, equipment which means that we have to take it out everything the cost is out even the depreciation must go that's why we record it on the debit side okay now moving to the next one they said on 1 april 2022 a new furniture okay maybe before we, we're still on number one eh? equipment is an asset when we buy this side, when we sell this side, we sell equipment, uh, which means that assets disposal. We record only cost, guys, under equipment account, thirty-five thousand. Okay. Now the next one on one April twenty twenty-two, a new furniture value one ninety-two was bought. We buy uh, on credit. Creators control uh, one ninety two thousand, and on the same day, EFT is cash was made for installation. You know that installation must form part of the cost price, okay? And the amount is three thousand, just like that, okay? Uh, we don't have any other transition, which means that we can close uh, this one. We are going to get amount of four five five thousand four five five thousand. Why four five five thousand outside? A ledger account must be equal, guys, always, which means that we're gonna have a balance here. You take this one minus this one, we're gonna get four twenty thousand and you do bro down this side balance. For twenty thousand. Okay, now remember, we still have to continue under accumulated depreciation. So we have a um, old uh, old equipment of two sixty. Uh, let's make calculate it. Okay, for assets disposal, guys, we are done. Let me wrap this part so that we can do uh, some calculation here. So this is how we are going to calculate. Okay, we have old uh, equipment and new equipment. Old equipment, we have two sixty. This one, two sixty. Our balance, two sixty, and we must first subtract thirty five thousand that we sold, and after that, this is cost price. We have to subtract accumulated depreciation, and accumulated depreciation balance. It was ninety thousand. It was ninety thousand, and we have to reverse the old one, the one that has been sold, sold and sold. Okay, then after that, uh, we can say multiply by twenty percent. Then it's gonna give you twenty eight thousand four hundred. Okay, so this is for depreciation of the old one. Okay, it's 28,400. Okay, then apart from this one, we have a new one that we need to add as well with this one. A new one was purchased. Uh, it was purchased on 1 April, which means that our year is ending June. We're going to say April, May, June. It's only three months. It was purchased by 192. If you still remember, it was purchased by... 195 192 or 195 yes 195 including installation 195000 uh, because there was no any uh, accumulated is minus 0 multiply by 20% and uh, then multiply by 3 over 12 it's going to give you 9750 then now you add it with this one 9750 okay and if you add them 
uh, they are going to give you amount where is it of 38,150 okay then if you do the balancing figure here you're going to get 132 350 132 350 okay which means that we're gonna have balance this side and the balance will be 121 150 and we do balance borrow down 121 150 just like that so this is how we do it grade 11 so make sure that you subscribe guys and also those who want to join our extra class please it's a class is only 60 rand per month let's make sure that you join so that every saturday we are gonna attend a live class together if you have any question you're gonna ask me on whatsapp so whatsapp is only for those who are attending our extra class guys because i won't be able to answer the whole country because people who are watching accounting solution sa they are more than half of a million so it's a lot of people so yeah i'm gonna see you on the next one guys don't forget to subscribe so that when i post grade 12 uh, videos you're just gonna get them see you